Hey everyone, I'm just going to make a quick video here, show you some of the cases for the GoPro Hero 4 that I like and uh, reasons why I like and dislike some of them. Um, so the GoPro Hero 4, um, this is the this is the waterproof case. I really like it. It's great for you know shooting underwater footage and whatnot, but the sound quality sucks. So um, I liked having the GoPro protected, you know, when you're on land just shooting regular photo, uh, regular videos and stuff. And um, but you can't you can't have good sound quality. You know, it, it muffles out it, it muffles out the sound just as much as it's muffling out the the water coming in. So um, the, the sound comes from. Uh, these little microphone here and then there's another one here on the side um, so when it's in the in the case it's um, it's you can't hear nothing so I went and got one of these these are pretty cheap on Amazon it comes with the it came with the little clip and the thing um, this was like two bucks on Amazon it's a skeleton case um, but it has access to the side port here which you can connect a microphone um, so this this is pretty nice for that reason there and it's in it does have the mount and everything so um but it leaves your lens your front and your back screen kind of susceptible to damage because they're open so i didn't really like that um uh you know if you're if you're dirt biking or you have it attached to a motorcycle or helmet or you're doing action sports it's, you know you kind of want your gopro protected so that's why I don't really like about the regular skeleton housing. Uh, it doesn't really protect your GoPro very well, and um, it doesn't protect the lens or the, or the LCD screen on the back. Um, so I got this this uh, case, which was on Amazon for maybe twenty bucks, I think, and it came with a it came with a wrench for the for the. To tighten, to tighten down your screw here. Uh, it has, it looks identical to the, um, to the waterproof case, only it has a cutout right here for, for your GoPro. Um, but I really like this case. Oh, because it looks identical, I wrote not for water on it, so me or my wife has decided to take it on our vacation. We, uh, we won't, hopefully we won't take it in the water by accident. So it protects the front, it protects the back. You have no access to LCD screen, uh, so that's a down. But um, you can navigate through the menu using the buttons or the GoPro capture app is pretty awesome. Um, it makes it easy to control your GoPro from Wi-Fi through your phone. Um, but what came with this case, I actually got a um, microphone with a, which, with a, an adapter right here. So this can connect, if you want to, you can connect this to your phone so you have better audio on your phone. Um, it's just a regular audio adapter. And then this connects it to the micro USB adapter on the side. And then you got great audio for your GoPro. And this is cheap. This is, I think for the case, the wrench, the audio and the adapter, I mean the microphone and the adapter, it was, I wanna say 22 bucks, somewhere around there. Um, and this makes it so you can take better quality videos with your GoPro. Um, what else is there? There's also another thing I got for for audio. I got a I forget what it's called, but one of these that clip on clip onto your clip it onto your collar, and it's got the audio jack with a micro USB adapter. Also, this was a couple bucks on Amazon. All this GoPro stuff on Amazon you can find super cheap. So it's not really, you know, for for the price, you you should probably you should probably invest in some better audio for your GoPro and some maybe some other cases um, because they will make your videos a lot better. Um, I also really like the uh, the tripod mount adapter. This is the, this part goes to my tripod. This part was for the GoPro. That's pretty handy because. Having a tripod for your GoPro for shooting time lapses is really handy. Um, so yeah, there's my uh, review on these three cases. Um, this one I don't think I'll get a lot of use out of, but I really like these two. The underwater one is essential for underwater because the GoPro Hero 4s are not waterproof. I believe the Hero 5 5s are. I don't know if there's a difference between Hero 5 Silver and Black, but I know that one of them has 
waterproof up to 10 meters. Um, just if you do get this case with this open side for your audio, make sure you somehow mark it that uh, not to use it in water or you know maybe put some orange or some some sort of marking so you know that you don't so you don't ruin your GoPro. But it's nice to have some quality audio for your videos. Um, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Comment in the section below if you want to see more videos like this. Um,